hello twin flames and welcome to the dm to the f reading for friday so today we're going to use two gorgeous decks both by my divine masculine blue eyes tarot the twin flame oracle and the divine masculine messages to divine feminine by george drew so let's see what your masculine wants you to know and i always pick up on such power when i'm using decks created by a divine masculine you know there's something really magical about these decks too so what does your masculine want to say to you today what does he want to say to you? You know, there's so many messages coming out right now about communication and, you know, how he feels your light and how that inspires him. So I feel he's kind of saying to you today, you are my sunlight, you are my muse. Thank you for guiding me home. And that card just moved on top too. So the energy today that he's saying, I'm seeking answers. I am seeking answers about our connection. Now, this really resonates with the masculine reading today because wherever he goes, whatever he's going through, whatever he's experiencing, he is receiving guidance. He is seeking answers within himself about the connection, about his journey, his mission, who he is, what he wants, where he's going. And he's receiving guidance from the things he's experiencing and the people he's connecting with. Even if he goes to a store, someone may serve him or he may walk past someone that reminds him of you. Someone who looks like you, talks like you, resonates you know, with your energy and wow, he's thinking about you. Someone may say something in a conversation or he may walk past somewhere there's a song playing or a car may go past with a song playing and it gives him an answer to something he's asking. So he's saying to you, I am seeking answers and I'm receiving the answers through my 3D world. Everything is a synchronicity. So he's receiving signs, number sequences, you know, synchronicities about you. And that's the way he's also receiving answers today. So he's saying, I'm, I'm, I know what I'm doing. I feel it. I understand. So it's like he really wants to get that across to you today. I'm feeling that channeled. I know what I'm doing. And sometimes on this journey, we don't trust that as a divine feminine. You know, we, we think we've got to give the answers. We have to point them in the right direction. We have to show them the way. And it's like we don't trust them enough. And your masculine saying, I know what I'm doing. I've come here to understand and learn what I'm doing. Please trust me to find my way. I know what I'm doing. And, you know, sometimes I'll say something to George and he'll say, Liz, I know what I'm doing, you know. So we have to trust them more. We have to remember that, you know, they are growing still and evolving still. But we have to let them go their own way. You know, sometimes it's like you've got a child on... Um, riding a bike and the bike has stabilizers on it and you know we have to take the stabilizers off at some point and allow them to go off by themselves and that's what we do as a divine feminine when we let go we take the stabilizers off and let them go their own way to find their own answers to understand themselves because sometimes you can tell your masculine the truth but it's like you might as well be banging your head on a wall because he's not going in there. They may be running, saying it is, it isn't real. They're not listening to what you're saying because they have to seek out their own answers. They have to come to their own conclusions. Most of the time, they know what you're saying is right, but they have to find it out for themselves. It's like your mask is saying to you today, I know what I'm doing. <laughs> Thank you, angels. Trust me. Wow, I've got angel bumps. Trust me, divine feminine. Trust me to come forward. Trust me to reach out. Trust me to love you the way that I want to love you. Surely the synchronicities and the signs are showing you that I am seeking my answers, that I am doing my work, that I am learning my way. Do you and allow me to do me. Trust me. This is the message, very beautiful. He's saying, I feel alone. So if you feel sadness, it's because he feels alone. And this is another way the universe shows him he is not alone. Shows him through the synchronicity. Shows him through other people he's dealing with. This is as well why the divine masculines sometimes are in other situations. Because as a divine feminine, we are strong. You know, we are warriors. We are of the light and we realize that very early on in our journey so we are okay with being alone you know we're okay with being single and independent and doing our own thing the masculine sometimes struggle with that 
Because remember, their journey is to learn to ask for what they want. So he's saying, I feel alone in this situation. So he may be with a karmic partner. He may have children around him. He may be surrounded by other people, but he feels alone. And the angel's showing through those people, through the things he's going through, that he has the power to choose himself because he's not alone. He's surrounded by your love. He's surrounded by light from heaven. He's surrounded by power. So if you feel sadness today or you feel a bit lonely, that's coming from your twin. And we can never be lonely on this journey when we embrace what this journey is because we understand that we are connected always with our twin but also with everyone else because we are all one. We're one with everything and everyone. Everyone who's ever walked the earth, everyone who is walking the earth now, we're connected with angels. We can't be lonely when we have heaven on our side. And he's saying, when it's quiet, my mind fills with you. So he's reminding you that in the silence, in those quiet times, those are the times he connects with you more and more through telepathy, through dreams, through the 5D realm. And that's where he seeks the answers because when he's quiet, when he's at peace, when he doesn't feel pressured, and that's why he can block you sometimes. His mind fills with you and he seeks the answers about you. He receives the synchronicities around the connection and he's asking you to trust him while he finds his way. I'm on mission and this is exactly what I'm feeling today. You may be thinking, when's he going to open up to his mission? What is his mission? And he's saying, I'm already on it. I'm on mission because I'm learning where I need to, to be with you. I'm understanding where I need to change to be myself. I'm understanding what I want to live my best life. I'm on mission. I am doing my work. Please trust me. I know what I'm doing. And I'm further on my journey than you think. Wow. And this is why we have to realize as a divine feminine that our masculine is wise. They are wise. You know, you're one soul. You may be of different earthly ages, but you are the same soul age. So you may see yourself as wise. Your masculine is just as wise as you. They're just going around it a different way than you. And that's why as a feminine, we get triggered and we get angry and frustrated because we would handle it differently. Well, that's your way of doing things. Your masculine does things differently. And that also happens so that you learn to trust it. So you don't get triggered. Instead, you heal and grow and learn and realize he's got his own way of doing things. He knows what he's doing. He's further ahead on his journey than you think and he's already on mission. And this is so real because, you know, as a divine family, so often we think, what's my mission? What am I supposed to be doing? But you're already on your mission because you're already doing what you're supposed to be doing. Every day you get stronger. Every day you understand things a little bit clearer. Every day you open up more to your psychic gifts and the intelligence that's deep within you. Every day you notice more and more signs, you're connecting more and more with heaven. That's your mission. And then at the right time, everything else will appear. So your masculine saying to you, I know what I'm doing. Please trust me to find my way and do my work. I hope this helps. Have a great day and I'll see you soon.